the mask will drop down and you'll feel like it's just, it just was yesterday. And you start just talk about, about whatever. Here you feel like you want to introduce yourself again from the beginning. Hello, I'm Nida. Um, I work for Amnesty International. Um, yeah, yeah, how are you? How, how is going? Blah, blah, blah. And it's the same, the same. Each Monday, I face people in the kitchen when I prepare my coffee. It's how was your weekend? It's a bit strange how like um, I found out my, myself because before when I first arrived the first year I was mixing. I was like feeling like bad after after work, going home and knowing nothing about my friends. Why they don't talk about their, their life? Why I don't I have uh, you know we don't speak about ourselves? Why we don't reveal secrets? Which is I don't like it. But in Lebanon no, we say everything. Is any place better or worse? Do you think it's better here? It's not as better. It's not about better. It's different. It's just... It's Before I was like... Mm, the first year I, I really had a problem because I couldn't understand how. How like uh, I can go home now, tonight, and don't speak with... Um, a friend of mine at work because she has her, she has now another life like at night or during the weekend she has different things to do she's not she's not like um, she's not willing to listen to me or she has no time to listen to me to my stories why she want to listen to my stories what happened I, because I used to call my friends daily when we come back home I pick up the phone and I call what happened with me during the day, day, during the day, and as well during the weekend. I can't have this um, like a cut from Friday to Monday. Friday and uh, Saturday and Sunday is different. And then on Monday, I come back to work and I don't need to explain what happened during the weekend. I'm not used to that. I need to explain what happened during the weekend. I need to have this continuously. Uh, with, with friends, with people I know, with people I like. But people here, like, um, let's say when you meet them next day in the kitchen, and in Amnesty Kitchen, daily, when I come to work, on Monday, I freaked out with the question, how was your weekend? And nobody talks about what happened on Friday, or what I, even if I saw them on the, on the weekend, let's say on a party, a house party or whatever. They don't speak about it. They don't say anything. There is no gossip. You know, like, and I mean, like, no gossip at, at all. And I don't know why, I don't understand it. Which for me, like, if, like, if in Lebanon, when I go on Monday to work, it's like continuous of talking about what happened last night. Have you seen it? It's fantastic. You've seen her clothes? It was reading something really interesting. I do love her. Like, and as well as this guy. He was all the night looking at you. Come on, what happened? Did you exchange number? Did he, did he call you? Why well, he didn't? Did you go somewhere with him? What happened? Go, go, come on. You know, it's like different. But here, even people, if you... But I was with you on the weekend. I've seen you, like, I've seen you on, uh, on, uh, on Friday. I've seen you on Saturday. Come on, why are you? Why ask me something different? Don't ask me how was your weekend. But I saw you on Friday on Saturday. Ask me about a fact, a specific fact happened on the weekend. I remember things. They don't remember things. I don't know. Or maybe it's just um, they don't like to cross the line of privacy. It is. It is. It's like that. The line of privacy is really interesting here, and it's not because it's, it's not because they don't want it. 
because maybe it's, it's a society, it's really an um, individual society, yeah. <laughs> which is, it is like, um, it's not about community, it's not about family. But now, it's really cosmetic dreams. It's really scary. But whatever, I can just go and do a plastic surgery. I don't mind it. Because it's hard to don't, you know, because there is no harmony between your, between your soul and your face. If you feel you are 25 and you are 40, you have to look 25. Three people. It's two Spanish and myself. Natalia, Edurne. Just my uh, age from 1 to 33. My birthday was on Saturday. My present from Natalia and Edurne was fantastic. Underwears everywhere and a ticket to Madrid. Because we're supposed to go three of us to be together. And now, because it's Christmas, we don't know if she can't go to Madrid. But she wanna go and visit her family. But three of us, we're going on the 11th. Street near um, the place where we ate uh, the nice food in Lebanon. A guy he is from, um, I think, Liverpool. He was living there during the 80s and he left Lebanon and now he came back and he wrote this book. It's a good one. <laughs> 